just how you planned it Life could put you in a pickle, just make sure it's kosher Lean on me like real witness until you smell the roses What's happening fam? Oh, LAR group is still moving, subscriber die trying You see the thumbnail man, summer body positivity I know, I know, it's that time of year you know, it was the most wonderful time of year, and now it's, you know, after the most wonderful time of year when you didn't gain 37 kilos. Um, and now it's the time where, you know, New Year's resolutions ain't really resoluting, but you plan to vacation in some beachfront, you know, property somewhere. And you're like, oh man, I'm about to do my whole... 13 sit-ups and 17 push-ups and I'm about to get swole on them, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to come out of the gym running like the ultimate warrior and he's in the 80s and early 90s. You know, swole. And I'm like, mm. Because I got to get my summer body. I got to get right for the summer. For the summer. So I'm going to eat right. I'm going to drink water. You know, that's right. Uh, I'm gonna do a cleanse. That's right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do cardio and yoga and yeah, I'm gonna swim underwater for you know five hours consecutively and never come up for air. Cause I gotta go to this beach and look sexy. And then when you go to the beach and look sexy, you eat everything at all the restaurants. You drink everything at the bar and gain thirty-seven kilos. But hey, it was worth it because whew, I put I, I worked out 16 weeks for this, and it's like, oh, here we go. So, but we gonna have some summer body positivity, you know. I should just put some of, but I'm gonna put summer. Uh, but don't I look good for the summer? Well, what about the fall? I mean, that's right after the summer. You gonna you gonna you gonna get right for the fall? Nah, not really. What about the winter time? Mm, no, nah, not really. What about, you know, springtime? Nah, no, nah, spring is the season where you get ready for the summer. And here's the interesting thing. I'm about to say this and it's going to hurt. You do all that working out to get your summer body ready and you still off. Your summer body ain't came in the summertime. You, you, need, a, you need another year for a summer body. But hey, man, it's the best I could do. You know, I, I lost 30 pounds, you know. Whew. You know, I went to be, I was built like Peter Griffin. Now I'm built like Dale Gribble, you know, Hank Hill, you know. You know what I'm saying? I lost, I lost most of the gut, but this deal, yeah, I got a muscle in my forearm from not really working out, but really, you know, you know what I'm saying? But, you know. So, you know what I'm saying, I got a little action going. And then it, it, and then it becomes really crazy. I've seen people focused so hard just to, I'm going to go on vacation. So you work out and try to eat right. And here's the other thing. Well, I say work out and try to eat right. I should say, I should say try to work out and try to eat right. Because what happens is you got to, I got a 16-week program. You only make nine of them. You take off the mother, <laughs> the mother seven. You're like, you know, I just, just quite ain't feeling it today. I just, I need to rest. <sighs> just need a week off. I need to get my, get it together. This is harder than I thought. I'm like, okay. You know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta put the snacks down. I'm gonna put them down tomorrow. I'm gonna get my summer body though. I promise. I'm gonna get my summer body. Now you taking laxatives all week to try to lose it. It don't make no sense. You know, it don't. You know, you done ran out of toilet paper in two days because you want to get your summer body. And then when you get there, you realize, you know, you go somewhere. And I hate to say this, you go somewhere for the, for the summer's vacation. And it was, a, it was a bunch of other people there who got their summer body together. And you just see people who almost got it together on average. So you don't feel bad. You're like, oh, look, look. they ain't got their summer body together either. So I feel good. I'm better than them. Whew. But I, I, I thought I was going to be super sexy. Yeah, you super average. Uh, so we got this whole other issue. 
And the issue is if you keep lower, lowering the bar, then you keep lowering the bar because what's going to happen? Hey, man, you know what? It wasn't that bad, you know. They was at the beach. I was at the beach. It was all average. It's, it's, I don't know what. We was looking for the finest of the fine, but, you know, we, we looking like the fell-offs of the fell-offs. You know, it's like, uh, I could do that again next year, you know. Now I know I don't have to get my summer body. Uh, you know, it's body positivity. As long as I got them good drinks and that good food, I can get these people to come around. And it's like, okay, all right, I see what you're on. I see what you're doing. You know, don't judge me. Hey, listen, no, I'm going to judge you. I'm going to judge you because you said you was going to get it together by summertime, and you didn't. And then you're going to say, don't judge me for not getting, to get, getting it together when you said you was going to get it together. And you're like, look, everybody else didn't get it together either. See, we're on, we're on a vacation rewarding ourselves for, for halfway doing it. But I look good. I don't look like I want to look, but I look good. So why don't you just keep, I tell you what, why don't you just keep, if you really want to look like that, why don't you just keep it up until after the, after the summer and after vacation? Why don't you get back on the ground? No, no, thank you. You know, worry about yourself. Worry about yourself. You know, but, hey, let's just have some summer body positivity out here. Just tell me what you think. Like, share, subscribe, or die, try, and catch y'all on the next one. Peace.